हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू एंट्री इंडिया बेस्ट चैनल टू क्रैक एनी ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट एग्जाम्स आई दीपनी भारद्वाज वेलकम यू ऑल अगेन ऑन योर फेवरेट चैनल सो वॉन्ट टू स्कोर गोल्ड मार्क्स इन एस बी आई पी ओ प्रीलिम्स ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इफ यस स्टार्ट प्रिपेयरिंग विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले एंड क्रैक द एग्जाम इन द फर्स्ट अटैम्प्ट इट सेल्फ द ओवरऑल प्रिपरेशन स्ट्रेटी इन्वॉल्व the identification of one strong and weak areas fortifying the strong areas and chipping away one's weaknesses with the help of good practice to begin with the sbi po preparation the first and foremost thing that candidate should do is to go through the exam pattern and syllabus this will give the candidates an idea regarding the overall structure of the exam as well as the topics they need to cover under each section so i'll be giving you few sbi po 2020 preparation tips and the examination strategy so let's begin with it so our exam that is sbi po would be conducted in three phases as everyone knows them the three phases are are prelims followed by mains and then the interview process everyone knows that and if we want to understand it in a better way so what we'll do i have divided the explanation with some important points so here are the some important points which are related to sbi po preparation so let's start with it see first of all we must know sbi po syllabus and our examination pattern moreover we need to check the previous year's question papers this is of utmost importance because because of the previous year's questions we can understand that what all type of questions come in in the exam and how they come then we need to brush up our basic skills basic skills must be brushed up anyhow then we must revise through the short video tutorials now how are you going to get it you will get it on our youtube channel moreover you can use them from our application as well we have our best application in which we provide you the courses with the video tutorials along with the mock test papers now build a section wise strategy to attempt the exam now what is the section wise strategy here we will discuss about the reasoning section or qa section or english section and so on analyze the mock test and identify the weak areas see when we will be able to give mock test after mock test we'll get to know that what all are weak topics for example if i talk about qa in quantitative aptitude we have different different topics for example time and work one might be very good in time and work but some sort of questions must be or may be difficult for him to solve so after giving mock test we can understand what all are our weak areas and what all are our strong areas read newspaper daily to increase your general knowledge skills see we all know that general awareness plays a important role and since it plays a important role we must read our newspaper daily and one more point that i haven't mentioned here you can regularly update yourself from the Q A or uh, sorry, from the current affairs from our YouTube channel as well. We on the daily basis keep on updating the new new current affairs. Moreover, these current affairs are available on our application as well. That is Entry Zap. Now practice regularly the numerical ability and problem solving skills, and do not do guess work to avoid negative marking. Many students. use this method that is there are five options and they think the uh, answer is going to be among these two uh, options so please please do not do the guess work because this guess work will lead you to the negative marking and many students have faced this issue that they were on the verge of selection i mean they just cross the boundary line and because of the negative marking their ball left just here that is they were about to cross the exam but because of the negative marking they were just below the boundary line so never do the guess work now we'll understand what is 
our examination pattern so first of all we'll discuss about the prelims exam as you can see prelims exam consists of three subjects that is english language followed by quantitative aptitude that are, that is our maths that is followed by the reasoning ability see there would be 30 questions from english and total time duration will be given 20 minutes for it for qa you will have 35 questions and timing would be 20 minutes similarly for reasoning you will be having 35 questions and the time duration will be of 20 minutes that is total timing will be of 60 minutes that is one hour and total number of questions would be 100 and total number of marks will be 100 now we'll discuss about the sbipo's mains exam see this mains exam is divided into two parts first the objective second the subjective in the objective part you will be having reasoning and computer in the combined form which will cover up 45 questions which would have 60 marks and time duration would be of 60 minutes if we talk about the data analysis and, and interpretation you'll have 35 questions from it total number of marks would be 60 and time would be of 45 minutes coming on the general economy or banking awareness section you'll have 40 questions from it with 40 marks and time duration to solve it would be of 35 minutes and when we'll talk about the english language as you can see you are going to have 35 questions with 40 marks and time to solve it would be 40 minutes and if we discuss about the subjective or descriptive test here for the english language you'll get a letter writing and essay where number of questions are two and marks would be of 50 and total time duration that is given to you is 30 minutes so overall you can see the total number of questions are 157 total number of marks would be 250 and the total time duration that you would be given is of 3.5 hours fine now let's discuss about the important preparation tips so here are some important points the first point is revise from the previous year question papers as already told earlier these previous years questions play a significant role in any of the exam no matter it is sbipo it may be rrb it may be ibps rrb or any of the exam previous years question always play the important role because from here we get to know what all the type of questions are going to come in the, in the exam and most important thing is that when you focus on the revision of the critical topics you should put the maximum effort into the topics with maximum weightage which is going to come in SBIPO exam see when we will get to know what is the maximum weightage for which topic you will easily be able to crack the exam because the, our first and the important point must be that we should be able to cut, clear the cutoff section and then our next step should be we must top the exam now our second point is revise the short tutorials as already told earlier we at entry are providing you short tutorials on our youtube channel as well as on our application so please revise with the short tutorials and a number of video tutorials are available on our application and youtube both these short video tutorials are very helpful for our revision third point build a strong section wise preparation tips there is a finite time to attempt each section in order to attempt the maximum number of questions can candidates must have a clear strategy to attempt each section if candidate want to attempt the reasoning ability section then they must pre-decide in the mind that what type of questions to be solved first in the section for example one can devote first five minutes to puzzle based question the next two minutes to the direction based questions and so on is that clear this point is also the important one now coming on the analyze your mock test see candidates should take the sectional and full length mock test during the preparation while in the last phase of the preparation candidates should not attempt too many mock tests also 
कैंडिडेट्स मस्ट एनालाइज देयर परफॉर्मेंस आफ्टर ईच मॉक टेस्ट वेन एवर यू गिव दी मॉक टेस्ट यूल गेट टू नो वॉट वर योर मार्क्स सेकेंड थिंग यूल गेट टू नो वॉट ऑल आर योर वीक एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग पॉइंट एंड वेन वील गेट टू नो अबाउट आर वीक एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग पॉइंट वी कैन वर्क ऑन दैट टॉपिक अकॉर्डिंगली फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ इट्स वीक वी आर गोइंग टू गिव मैक्सिमम टाइम ऑन दैट टॉपिक एंड इफ इट्स स्ट्रॉन्ग वील जस्ट यूज दैट फॉर द रिविजन वर्क एंड वील नॉट वेस्ट एक्स्ट्रा टाइम ऑन इट एंड गेट टू नो अबाउट दी न्यू न्यू कॉन्सेप्ट नाउ बी क्लियर विद दी कॉन्सेप्ट कैंडिडेट शुड बी क्लियर विद दी कॉन्सेप्ट द स्टैंडर्ड ऑफ एस बी आई पी ओ सिलेबस इज ऑफ ग्रेजुएशन लेवल एज यू नो दैट सिंस इट्स ऑफ ग्रेजुएशन लेवल दैट मीन्स एवरी कैंडिडेट नो मैटर हु हैज गिवन और हु इज फ्रॉम बी टेक बैकग्राउंड और ही इज फ्रॉम बी कॉम बैकग्राउंड और ही इज फ्रॉम बी एस सी बैकग्राउंड इफ ही इज ग्रेजुएट ही इज गोइंग टू गिव द एग्जाम कैंडिडेट्स कैन क्लियर दियर बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ क्वान्टिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड एंड रूल्स ऑफ ग्रामर फ्रॉम दियर high school books it seems quite awkward but yeah you can clear your concept from your high school books as well now devise section wise preparation strategy candidates needs to prepare a strategy for each section of the exam the study plan should be that candidates divide equal time to each section of the exam here we are talking about the section wise preparation so please get to know about it that we are going to have a different different section it may be of reasoning it may be of english here we have a certain slot of time so you have to work on it now learn shortcuts everyone knows what shortcut shortcuts are candidates learn shortcuts for solving questions since there are sectional timings learning shortcuts will help candidates to attempt maximum questions in the least possible time it's a very simple funda that when you will take the least time and solve the maximum questions your selection is sure sort the only thing is that you must have good accuracy on it now increase the practice as i tell you in all of my videos that practice makes men perfect so we must know that no matter which exam it is practice is going to solve any of the difficult question in the main exam so please remember candidates can practice with more and more sectional tests take one mock test every day practice on the computer for optimum results many students do what they take any offline test series for example they'll purchase a book or any of the guest papers and start solving it but since we have to sit on the computer over there and on the system we have to give, give exam so please give every exam as if it's your the real exam so please make your every exam as a real exam making real exam is going to be of important role you will get to know that when we are sitting on the computer we will be able to give the exam in the less time in comparison to when we are solving the offline mode or we are using any of the offline method and then sitting in the in the exam we will see that we have taken a extra time so please increase your practice and that to on our system now guess work should be limited as already told earlier guess work is quite difficult concept or rather i'll say the person who is just about to cross the exam remains just below the boundary line because of this concept because it gives us uh, gives us the negative marking so please in sbpu exam there is negative marking and we all know that so get rid of this negative marking and since there is negative marking for incorrect responses therefore i'll advise candidates not to do the guess work never do it now last but not the least point at last i would like to say please avoid spending too much time in any of the question while attempting the exam do not get stuck in any of the question if candidates are unable to understand the question then leave that be careful 
while attempting questions based on the puzzle that is a reasoning section so these all were are important points or are important preparation tips for sbi po i have also prepared sbi po's individual subjects preparation tips that you will get in other videos as well so please remember these points these points are going to play a important role in your life and you will be able to crack exam in the first attempt itself so thanking you for watching this video please please join your the entries application because the mock tests are going to be of important role in the selection so thanking you for watching this video if you have any doubts or any of the thing that you want to convey or say comment section is available for you please share this video like this video and subscribe the channel so that you keep on getting updates and get selected in the first time thanks a lot